Good morning, good morning, good morning, everybody. So I am about to make some smoothies this morning. It is a beautiful Sunday morning here. I want to show you guys just how quick and how easy it is to meal prep your smoothies, okay? So all you're going to need, if you're going to do some greens, always recommend some type of green. So it could be kale, spinach, romaine, whatever you want to do green-wise, okay? So you're just going to put just about a cup in here. I'm going to do more than a cup, clearly. <laughs> but it's all right. So really just a handful is good. And as you can see here, I have apple, strawberry, orange smoothie that I'm going to make, strawberry, banana, and fruit berries. So simply just label your um, Ziploc bags or freezer bags so you know what you're going to put in there, okay? So each one of them, I'm going to start with just a handful of my greens. I'm going to place that in there. So here. And truly, you don't have to measure your greens, but you just don't want to overstuff your cup with greens. But so pretty much a handful or approximately a cup of that. All right, so each one of my smoothies are going to start with the same base, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. Then for my strawberry banana, it's a pretty large berry, so... careful of how much you put in there because you don't want to put too much. It's about a one and a fourth cup is what our meal plan calls for. So one and a fourth cup. So I'll put one here and then I'm going to do a half of uh, my banana here. These I had already um, put in a bag previously in the freezer. So just a uh, food saving tip there for you. When your banana is about to go old and you know that you're not going to eat them, go ahead and just Break them in half and then put them in the freezer, okay? So you're going to just take your banana and throw it in the bag, okay? So that's my strawberry, strawberry banana um, smoothie already ready to go, okay? And then I have my apple, strawberry, and orange. So these are apples that I had already cut up here. I just took my apple slicer, did that chopped it up so again you just want to measure it out again got one one fourth cup of your fruit there and pour it right into your bag all right so apple oh sorry i did say a little bit of strawberry so i'm just going to add a few of those not too many so there you go all right and then my last one is my fruit berry smoothie so I just had a berry medley here so I'm going to pour same amount into here All right. so of course you're going to be adding your wet ingredients like your yogurt and then you know if it calls for sometimes vanilla or chia seeds and things like that I just say do that the morning of versus trying to do it um, in advance because you don't want to put frozen smoothie in here it's going to make it difficult to get out but just at least have this ready so all you have to do is pop it into your blender put in your yogurt if you're going to use yogurt put in your water that which tends to be a cup of water um, with your ingredients and then blend it all together and you're all ready so that is three smoothies all prepped and ready so super duper easy guys just wanted to show that to you especially if you are a mom or a busy person which is pretty much every adult living um <laughs> so you will pretty much have that already so i'm going to pop that into my freezer and be good to go so if you guys see this live number one hello thank you guys for joining live uh, be sure to share this out with your friends if you see this comment below and let me know what your favorite type of smoothies are if you are a breakfast smoothie type of person you can even do this at lunch i have a co-worker that brings her uh nutribullet to work and she just takes this and places it in the freezer and then she pulls out her nutribullet and then has her smoothies at work and guys these uh, actual smoothies that we're making they are in our meal plan 
Um, so feel free to um, get that meal plan, which I'm actually on myself now, which is why I am prepping these smoothies. And I'm sharing this with you guys because I'm going to be making these exact smoothies this week. I'm not doing this just for demo purposes. This is exactly what I do on my Sunday to get ready for my meal plan. So that's three smoothies already pretty much prepped for this week. So thank you guys again for joining in. If you're here live, do say hello because of course I can't see who's on here, but I love, love, love when you guys come on and interact. Thank you guys for liking and sharing and all that stuff. And again, like I said, make sure you comment below and let me know what type of smoothies you like to make. And if you're going to use this method, if you've never seen it before and you've never tried it before, to help you get your meals planned for the week. All right, guys. Thanks so much. And I hope you guys have a blessed week. Bye.